Before you start playing, make sure that all the valves are oiled. And also check to make sure all the spit is emptied from the tuning slides. And then you should be ready to begin. And when you're sitting holding the baritone, keep both feet on the ground and make sure your back is straight so that your back and your legs form a 90 degree angle. The proper way to hold the baritone consists of keeping your fingers on all the keys so that you can easily press down the valves and you hug the instrument so you're going to wrap your arm around the front of it. You can either latch on to over here on the far side or you can hold on to where the key ring is. Breathing is a crucial part when you're playing your instrument, especially when you need to get a strong, solid sound. It's going to travel from your lungs, your diaphragm is going to push it out, your lips are going to buzz it, and it's going to go through your mouthpiece and then through your instrument. Make sure you inhale until you feel as if your lungs cannot hold any more air. And you do not want to be breathing through your nose or else you can get a nosebleed. It might seem a little ridiculous at first, but it's actually a good idea to start playing with the mouthpiece. So you're going to buzz your lips, and then you're going to put your mouthpiece up to your mouth and do the same thing. If you have a handy piano at home, you can even practice hitting the keys and trying to match the sound, like this. That was a low B flat. Now let's do a high B flat. up with the B flat scale. This is one of the most common scales you'll probably ever play on the baritone. It starts with a B flat. Then it goes to a C. If you're playing euphonium, it's going to be the fourth valve, but if you're playing baritone, it's one and three. D. cheeks, that's not going to get you a really good sound. Instead, you want to keep your cheeks in and it's all on the lips. Don't use your cheeks in this. Now the last part in playing the baritone is practice. And with practice every day, we'll do this one day.